Look at this grin on Kasuga's face, everybody. <laughs> That's funny. I wonder, I'm sure he's going to change his pose and everything, right? He's going to change it over the course of the game when he does different uh, jobs. But what a grin on his face to start. All right. Welcome to part two of Like a Dragon Infinite Wealth. Hope you enjoyed part one. It's a pretty interesting intro so far. Notably, I like the improvements to the combat engine, and I like the graphics, which are very high frame rate on the Xbox Series X. Really enjoying this. So let's continue with our intro segment. See where it takes us. Looks like they want us to cross the street. My eyes peel for items as we run down these streets here. Ah, here's one. Two. A supreme herb and burn ointment. Anything there? Nope. <clears throat> Derek is hoping Psycho will be at Survive. I don't think she will be. Is it Seiko? Is it Seiko or Psycho? I think it's Seiko, correct? Man, I can't remember how to pronounce the certain names. Look, a food and general store. Did I say? <clears throat> High-end kimchi and a safety brooch. This is 10 defense. Can we buy it? Yeah, let's buy it. There you go. 10 defense. If I'm buying the safety brooch. Very nice. Say Sayako. Not Psycho or Seiko. Sayako. Okay, got it. Gotta remember. <clears throat> Sayako. Would you knock into the river? What the hell? Look at this. Cool. It's the hosts from the host clubs and they got bottles. <sighs> They're drinking from their bottles. A biting barker. Man, no way to line them up, huh? I want to knock this guy into the water if I can. Oh, I used to kill them, so I guess I don't need to. Nice, perfect guard. Oh, oh, oh. I'm gonna get the wall. <clears throat> the biting barker. Rank up. So, rock swing, new skill. Cool. <clears throat> Alright, we're in another part of town from the first game. Ichiban, our store's over here. Come by. What is she doing with her hand? <laughs> what are you doing? <clears throat> Anything back here? Can't go into any... Oh! I can't go into any of these. What did that say? Cognitive what? Medicine that will cure, stun, and restore 50 HP. Okay. <clears throat> Ice fragments and a paper plate. I don't know what I'm supposed to do with the paper plates. Superior herb. <clears throat> oh, wait, were we going the right way? We were. Survive bar from the first game makes a return appearance. We certainly were in here many, many times in the first game. <clears throat> I'm glad you're enjoying this, Jade. Well, is the gang all here? Uh, the gang's all damn, here. That's what... Hey, Namba. You come here straight from work? Yeah. Uh, I've been on my feet all day, so this is just what the doctor ordered. Uh, he's a medical Bartender, equipment inspector now. Another round. On me. <laughs> well, you've certainly moved up in the world. How have you been holding up, Sachan? The club's still running? Running like it's on its last legs. Co-owner of Club Silky all Queen. All things considered, though. I guess you could say we'll survive. Huh. Well, that's good. One thing's for sure. I won't let everything Nono Mio worked for go to waste. Mm. Someday, it'll be the hottest club in all of Yokohama. Interesting. You guys are welcome to visit any time, you know. <laughs> sure. Just don't go up charging us, huh? You know that's not how I do business. And if it was, you bums couldn't pay up anyway. <laughs> She ain't lying. Beer's here. Oh. Oh. Who it is? Oh, right Same guy still runs out of the bar. <laughs> Tonight, I say we get plastered. 
<laughs> Just so long as you don't end up on the floor. Yeah. All right. Then what's there? We have another toast. <laughs> Cheers. <laughs> Cheers. <clears throat> Very nice. This is a cool reminiscing about the first game. It's like a good intro for that. If you really enjoyed the first one, you're gonna love this intro to the game. Of course, what's gonna go wrong that so, we all have to have another journey? You make it, huh? <clears throat> yeah. <clears throat> same with Junki Han. Man, what gives? This is our first time grabbing beers in six months. Oh, they're just looking out for so, us. Well, this is the core team. They're still part of the underworld, so they can't exactly pal around all the time, you know? It really is a shame, though. Yeah. Either way, Kasuda's right. We were living in two different worlds that just aren't meant to cross paths. Especially if we want to keep these new lives we've built for ourselves. Plus... It's not like we'll never see them again. Like they say, no news is good news. Yeah. So, how's everyone been holding up? Still keeping at it with Arakawa-san's parting gift? Well, I got a long road ahead, but I'm chipping away. Adachi-san's already helped out a ton. <laughs> You're telling me? Rinky Dink op like mine can't just pull jobs out of thin air. <clears throat> oh, really? I'm grateful. Ah, I'm just ribbing you. You're doing great, pal. <laughs> <laughs> Not that you're any richer for it. <laughs> you never change, do you? Nope. But in a way, that's what makes him cool. Oh, <laughs> you think? <laughs> Hey, I'm gonna use the restroom. Uh, the restroom's unlocked, right? No. To break the door down. Well, how are things going with Sacha? Huh? <laughs> huh? Like how they both you turned two, to uh, him. Gone on <clears throat> yet? Oh my god. Wait, what? What are you talking about? Uh, that settles it. He hasn't done squat. Oh, you know, I figured you might be too busy to date, but I didn't think it was that bad. <laughs> what a bust. Hey, hold up. What's with you? Kasuga, you got a thing for Sajan, right? I... Uh, well... Um, like we wouldn't find out. Your face says it all. <laughs> don't tell me you didn't notice all that extra space we've been giving you. You what? Well, don't worry about all that. The important thing is, if you're gonna make a move, now's the time, huh? You're both living pretty stable lives at this point. You ought to be able to think about stuff like that now. Y yeah, but... Yeah, you can make excuses all you want. That won't help if someone else swoops her up, will it? I'm sure sachan has got a few deep-pocketed regulars here and there. You might have more competition than you think, huh? Oh, I'm no good with that kind of stuff, though. I wouldn't know where to start. <laughs> yeah, let's just hope Sasaki doesn't see you like this. <laughs> but seriously, you should ask her out <clears throat> when we leave here tonight. Something like, want to hang out together, just the two of us? That's enough for now. Hey, good thinking, Adachi san. Guess a veteran knows best. <laughs> ah, now you won't even look at her. <laughs> what now, Adachi san? Got some new scheme in the works? <laughs> I might. Oh, yeah, Sachan. The other day. Oh, my God. Will this be a whole theme of the game now? <clears throat> These two. There was nothing Ooh, like that in the yep. first one. So this is like coming out of nowhere. You're right, Namba. We're zigzagging. All right. Easy. I'll go with you. I gotta head to the station either way. No, no, fine. Honest. No. Maybe on the inside. All right. We'll see you later. Let's do this again sometime. You can barely huh? stand. Sure thing. <laughs> see you around. No. You got one life, pal. Aim true. Fire away. A dodgy son. Come on, Namba. Let's roll. <laughs> He's like a zombie. Hey, hey, slow down. 
<laughs> you think I'll be all right? <laughs> oh well. Guess I should go too. See you later, Ichiban. <sighs> and he says nothing. He wusses out. <clears throat> uh, such a wait. The hmm? um nothing. Nothing. Come on, spit it out. No, forget I said anything. <sighs> okay. Well, good night. Sachan! Ichiban, seriously, what's gotten into you? Sorry. Listen. Do you maybe, uh, want to hang out sometime? Huh? <laughs> what? You already planning our next get together? We decided to do the next one at my club, remember? Uh, no, um, not like that. <laughs> I mean, oh just my us. god, it's so awkward. You know, <clears throat> together. <laughs> the whole thing froze! She ran away! <laughs> she ran the hell away! <clears throat> Wow. I blew it. Fetal position. Oh, I blew it. Man, what now? <laughs> <sighs> oh, shit. Uh, 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 hello? Sorry, I, I sort of panicked. I didn't expect that. No, uh, I'm sorry. It was rude of me to spring that on you like that. You know, I'm free next Saturday. Oh, God. Uh, Something's going to go horribly uh, wrong. You know it. We're going to hang out, right? Just the two of us? Uh, wait. You mean... I'm looking forward to it. <laughs> anyway, see ya. <clears throat> <laughs> oh, my God. Exactly, Apostate Kid is what a goober. <laughs> Keep in mind, he was in jail for 20 years, right? He was literally in jail for 20 years, so, like, he hasn't had any exposure to, like, social stuff. His exposure was the last game, right? So he hasn't had any way to, to have this kind of, like, knowledge of, of experience of having to have a relationship. So he's acting like a, like a teenager, you know, even though he's not. <laughs> Oh my god. What's up, John? Familiar bomb. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What the hell? Cut it out, will you? What's up with you two? Hey, buddy! Guess what? I did it! You did what? I did it! You're a week of food! Oh, come on! This is huge, fellas! <laughs> this guy has to take pictures. This guy's crazy. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Call the police. Wow. <laughs> All right, that was pretty funny. <clears throat> but like I said, in line with this game, you know what's gonna happen? Something's gonna go horribly wrong, like ridiculously no wrong. Oh shit! <clears throat> and she really said yes. Good for you. She's a hell of a girl. Nah. <clears throat> so why do you look so down? Well, it's just. I was locked up from the time I turned 24. I don't have much experience, Dave. Right, didn't they say in the last game he was, like, just about 40 years old? So he was locked up for a long-ass time, and now this is even a few years after that. Especially not with a grown woman like Sachon. <clears throat> oh, are you that nervous? Hey, end of the day, dates come and go. No need to stress out. But what if it all goes to hell and we never recover from it? But what if she never wants to see me again? <laughs> Don't forget it. I'm calling the whole thing off. Man, 
and she'll definitely hate you if you cancel on her now. What am I supposed to do? Where do we go? What, what do we eat? What do we talk about? I've never thought about this stuff before. <laughs> <laughs> all right, now take a breath. <clears throat> Leave all that to the experts. <laughs> oh yeah, we got this. Oh yeah, trust them. Wait, right. You two really help me out here? Sure. Who's got more experience than us? Like this is your big chance, after all. We're gonna help you make the most. This of is going to go horribly nice. wrong. Horribly, Change horribly wrong. Ways. Okay. <clears throat> Let's get started then. What is first when it comes to date prep? Easy. Before you do anything else, relax. Dates are nothing but people getting to know each other. It's all just human nature. Act natural. I guess that makes sense. Human nature. What? No, that's not it. Huh? But, um, a woman's not looking to just chew the fat on a date. You want to woo her. Give her a night she'll remember. Forget acting natural. You stay sharp and be the perfect version of yourself. Okay, right. <laughs> I need to make everything special. Uh, but how do I do that while acting natural? Like Namba said. Look, I'm the most experienced here. Yeah. <laughs> Just listen to what I tell This is what I say. Forget oh, him. Hell no. The only thing <clears throat> you sounds more experienced than is paying for. You little... Exactly how many girls did you take back to the old cardboard box, huh? Oh, so that's how it's gonna be. Uh, guys? Uh, it's this room. That's too hard to think in here. Let's hit the town. That'll get Namba and me inspired, yeah? Of course, as to which of us you listen to, <laughs> well... You can make that call. Alright, will they join us now? Good idea. I'll show you just how to win a woman's heart. Let's go. All right, so Derek looked it up. He says, on a website, it says, Sayako is probably in her mid-30s. Namba's 41, Ichiban is 42, and Adachi is 59. So those okay. are their accurate I, uh, uh, ages for this game. I appreciate it. <clears throat> okay. Got it. <clears throat> you need my dating advice? My dating advice is probably outdated. Like, my best dating advice is you get a big club... And you just whap the woman over the head. You sling her over your shoulder. You bring her home. But that's, you know, a little, late, a little old. I don't think that applies to the modern day. Probably not a good idea. So, um, <clears throat> what are we doing here? Shh, 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 Kasuga. Class is in session. Uh, what? Lesson one in the art of love. Waiting. Oh, my God. <laughs> Waiting for what? <laughs> Listen up. The date's begun the moment you reach the meeting spot and assume position. It is vital to arrive ahead of time by an hour, maybe two. And two hours and early. Late, like a man. Right. Remember, when the girl arrives, she's going to take one look at you and register a full impression. That impression doesn't wash off. It can take years to fix. I get it. First impressions, yeah? Makes sense. I have to admit, he's right. So, show us how you'll wait for Sacha. Okay, sure. Wait, what do you mean? I'll just, you know, stand? No, <laughs> too stiff. <laughs> Every fiber of your body is nervous. You want Sacha to feel at ease. Oh, crap, really? Uh, then, uh, how should I stand? Who said anything about standing? Hey, why don't you park yourself on that bench there? Maybe even doze off a bit. Uh, the what? You want me to fall asleep while I'm waiting? Yes. What did I say earlier? Dates should be natural. Now listen, who in the world has seen your sleeping face besides people you trust and have opened up to? Uh, my cellmates, maybe? <laughs> Forget about all that. The point is for Sacha to think, Wow, Ichi must feel so comfortable with me. Oh, and he looks like a person's puppy when he's shooting. She'll want to protect <laughs> Are you sure about this, man? What do you think, Adachi-san? Dozing off on a park bench? Huge mistake. What did we say before? A girl wants to feel special. That all starts with your posture. How do you make someone feel special with your posture? Remember the rule. 
30 minutes early at least then you stand silent like a statue right don't look around just hold your gaze firmly in the direction she'll be coming from. <laughs> when Sachan shows up and gets a load of that she'll be putty in your hands Ichiban she'll think I've never noticed how manly and passionate he seems get it okay yeah and maybe it'd be good to show her that side of me oh my god whatever Ichi you can't do both which of our strategies are you going with here you have to choose? Have to choose. You have to choose one. Sit and act natural, stand and pose. There's a difference between acting natural and going to sleep, right? I think... I think stand and pose is kind of stupid. Sit and act natural. Going with you, Namba. Style up. I figure sitting down <laughs> while I wait will help me conserve strength for later. There you go. <laughs> right on the money. You always keep as much in the tank as you can. Oh, hold on a second, Kasuga. How do you feel getting to the meeting spot, right? And there's Sachan, conked out, snoring. There's a sleep. Oh, <laughs> I guess I think she was exhausted from working all day. Oh. Yep. <clears throat> she finds you asleep while you were waiting for her. You're no puppy dog. You just look like every other sad sack salary. <laughs> She'll spend the whole day wondering if you're really awake or out on your feet. Oh, damn it, you're right. <laughs> that, my friend, is why you stand firm. You're a proud soldier on your way to win the war. Um, I don't know if that's really how I want to imagine this date, but... <laughs> I admit, I didn't get just how much my posture would matter. I'll be sure not to look tired or sloppy. Thanks. That's right. <laughs> ah, there we go. So, how about lesson number two? Boop a doo boop. Scoop a doo boop. Wow. Art of Love, lesson two. Location, location, location. Yes, that's exactly what I need. Someplace fancy we can go. Huh? Fancy? Uh-oh. Here we go. Yeah. The date should be special. That's what you said. So, like, a nice Italian or French restaurant? Oh, yes, we did. Ah! You guys are kidding me. A fancy restaurant? No, oh, Ichiban, it's like you're studying some kind of date man. <laughs> exactly. It's too obvious. You'll make her feel like you're running on autopilot. Kasuga, you need a spot that says you picked it just for her. Someplace just for her, huh? Like what? Like, uh, ooh, Indian curry. A curry place? Not just any curry place. That one has a secret menu. You can order a curry what? there, spice level one. Yeah, sounds like a great idea. That's 1.2 million on the Scoville scale. <laughs> 500 times spicier than Tabasco. Uh... 500 <clears throat> times spicier? Yep. Even the most spice-hardened bastards run from those numbers. No one's ever finished a whole bowl. Now you tell me. What'll Sachan think when you conquer that beast right before <laughs> her eyes? <laughs> oh my god! I'm not that into spicy food, man. Uh. Moron! That makes it even better. Suffer for her. <laughs> Let her see you wipe. It's like a, a, like a college guy bow. trying to do a stupid stunt, it's the right? Struggle that's sexy. How oh, she'll be buddy in your Oh hands. my god, what an idiot. <laughs> really? Idiot? What happens when the curry wins? You'll just be a quivering, snotty bastard. He's right. Namba's right That's there. That's true. Listen to what I'm trying to tell you. Act natural. Don't be someone you're not. And don't trip over yourself finding somewhere new. Go somewhere you always go. <laughs> Maybe, but for me, that's mostly just beef bowl places. Well, have some beef bowl. <laughs> Come on, what? A beef bowl date? You think it's against the law or something? All that matters is that you stay relaxed. And right now, that means meatballs. It's true. Oh I my guess. god. So be nervous heading to some Italian uh, or French place. So in one case, it's way too over the top, like you're pulling a stunt, which she's not gonna fucking care about, right? Like you're trying to act like you're some kind of a hard ass because you can eat a spicy meal. In the other case, it's something so common and basic 
that it's like, you know, would you ever go on a date to McDonald's? Yeah, if you're already going out with someone and you just need something quick to eat, you don't go there on a first date, right? So one's going way too crazy in one direction and one's going one too crazy in the other. Where's the middle ground? Dumbass! Beef bowls don't win hearts. Show her you're a champ. Spice level 100. Are my only options really beef bowls or the hottest curry on the... earth? Or you could always just give up, wallow in indecision, grow old and alone. Make a choice. <laughs> uh, seriously? Here we go again. Fine. I've got to choose. Then. I don't think she's going to care about him eating a level 100 curry, so. Then Confidence up. Beef bowls, yes. What? Beef bowls on a date? You lose your mind? I know it's not perfect, but I keep thinking of Sajan sitting in silence while I tackle that curry. She's, you, you know, watching you with pride. <laughs> She's in awe of your, your bravery. Oh, my God. Have I ever had beef bowl before? Only my wife's made beef bowls for us, Japanese style. You got to get this thin shaved steak. And you cook it with uh, murin and a bunch of seasonings. And you fry eggs up and you cook them together. And you add some onion. And you have it over white rice. It's super duper good. But we never had it like a restaurant. Just the recipe she found online and then perfected. So, uh, Does that sound like Sachan to you? <clears throat> Am I taking her out just to perform for her? Uh, exactly. Of course you Stupid. are. Stupid. It's about impressing her. Maybe, but isn't the whole point of a date to talk with each other? Exactly. I'd rather do that over dinner than win some food check. Exactly right. Well, uh, <laughs> you got it. The lesson behind the lesson. <laughs> Precisely, Ichiban. <laughs> Thanks. And uh, that means beef bowls are out of the question, too, right? Uh, they might help me relax, but it wouldn't be that special for Sancho. I guess I've just got to find a spot we'll both like. Exactly. Uh, yeah, precisely. <laughs> yeah. Now you get it. You saw through my trick and realized the true lesson underneath. You know, he's really not that close. <laughs> oh, you're right. Maybe all he's actually missing is confidence. Exactly. Gotta say, I, I wasn't sure about this before, but you guys really do have me feeling readier for this date. So, what's next? <laughs> right. And it's time for the final lesson. What the hell's the last one gonna be? Uh... Here we are then, the final course in the art of love. Oh, okay, I think I see what's coming. Give it to me. What's wrong with how I dress? I mean, this suit's natural, isn't it? Uh, far from it, I'm afraid to say. <laughs> Highly unnatural. Far from it. You're a weirdo. Is that a natural fabric color? Remember, we're after human nature here. Try something like this. Ah, <laughs> light colors. This is a date outfit? It doesn't look that stylish. Nothing's more stylish than all natural. Oh, natural. Oh, natural. It's trendier these days than an organic lifestyle. Yeah, there's gonna be some gaudy thing. These Watch. Days, they're pure cotton and hemp. Hemp! Not an ounce of artificial color. Oh, my God. An environmentally friendly ounce. Oh, my God, no. I get it. It's another way of... Keeping things natural. But Sachan, it won't it surprise her? I mean, she's never seen me dress this way. Stop worrying. The call of nature affects everyone. Oh my god. Sachan will know on a primal <clears throat> level that this is sexy. The hipster in Seattle outfit, Don't yes. It's Yo, oh, no na unnatural byproducts, no dyes, no chemicals, made from hemp so you can get high afterwards. It's so good. This is exactly what someone here would wear. Be sold mm. love For sure. Love <clears throat> oh, uh, really though? Look, I get the value of being environment. Temp is a offshoot product of marijuana. It doesn't get you high, but basically the people are like, oh, there's other things you can do with marijuana. Like you can make clothing out of it, and, and out of this fabric that they make, they call it hemp. So that's what that is. When will I arrive to the stream in a hemp suit? I don't know. Maybe I should get a full hemp suit and wear it on stream. Would you guys like that? Hey, come on. Maybe this shirt is made of hemp. I don't know. I never checked. 
You're trying to win a girl's heart, not save the whales. <clears throat> Cosplaying is some kind of burlap beatnik isn't about to make Sachan go gaga. There you go. Okay, Adachi san, what do you He's gonna say some gaudy thing, why? Aha! Uh -huh. Feast your eyes on this masterpiece of sartorial seduction. Look at that. Holy shit! You don't think this is a little too flashy? Kasuga, why does the firefly illuminate in the dark? Duh. What? It's the male's method of courtship, obviously. Dazzling your beloved, captivating them. It's an instinct every living thing on Earth shares. Obey your instincts, Kasuga. Light up her life, and Sachan will be putty in your hands. <laughs> Whoa. Oh, when you put it like that, this suit is pretty amazing, isn't it? Yep. Now, don't you want to show up in that instead of Namba's crap? <clears throat> Damn, you're right. We gotta choose again. We both made good points. It's all right, Ichiban. Just go with your heart. Okay, I will. I'm wearing this one. I mean, honestly, if it were me choosing, I would go for the Razzle Dazzle. I don't want to wear that organic, kippy shit. Give me the Razzle Dazzle. Adjust Style up. It's yours. I know that human nature is important, but special occasions demand special action, don't they? <laughs> all right. I've said all I have to say. Give it your all. Make it one for the history books. Damn straight. We got you as far as we can get you. <laughs> now it's up to you, Kasuga. All right. You two, watch. I'll make you proud. Where are they gonna end up? This is gonna be the biggest fail ever. Watch. Like I said, something crazy is gonna happen. They're gonna attack or something. <clears throat> if the day goes well, it's all because of them. Namba Adachi san, thank you. I should get back home for now. So now you can view their character profiles. I was actually hoping they would stick around with you and you could do some combat with them, but it doesn't look like that's the case. Alright, well. Let's head back. What an intro. We're 90 minutes in, and the story is interesting, but. You know, really, this isn't the main game yet. You can tell this is all their setup, right? This is the big setup segment. So there's definitely going to be a lot going down. I get the feeling in our first stream of three hours here, we're not really going to get that far into the plot. It's, it's going to be a lengthy, lengthy game. They did say this is the longest ever game made by Ryuga Gotoku, or whatever the heck the name of the group is. I always botch it. This is their, their biggest, longest endeavor ever. So probably going to take quite some time to get through it. Hey, hey! Cool. More biting barkers. Oh, wait, he has a new move, doesn't he? Hold on. Rock swing. Move from Kasuga Schoolyard Wrestling Days. Damages an enemy with a high chance of a critical hit. Let's try it. X, look at this. Why? Oh, I mistimed it. It did great damage, but I missed time to Y. Perfect guard. Nice perfect guard. Not an enemy in sight. Very good. I level up again. Oh my god. These initial fights you level up real fast. What was that? There's an item in the bush. Natural earth. Oh no. The hobo wants to fight. Run away! Derek says he would tackle level 100 curry for Say Sayako-chan, and that would be the last time you ever see Sayako-chan. <laughs> Women don't want crazy stunts. Come on. Come on! No stunts. Oh, crap. Like I said, Neither Namba or Adachi are completely correct. Each one of them have a little bit of seeds of truth in what they're saying, but neither of them are right. They're too, they're too extreme. Look where we are. We've arrived at the arcade. So you can do Spike Out. Blast City. Oh, look at this. It's a fighting game. Blast City? Spike Out? I don't even know... I never played Spike Out. 
We can catch some, uh, some guys here. Here we go. Hold on. What should we get? Get a cute, a cute teddy bear. Insert your money. So how does this work? Move the claw left. Okay, we're trying to get the green bear. We get the green bear. Grab that big head. Lift it. Don't you dog! Okay. Oh, oh, oh! Shit! I might not get something this time. Damn, usually I get something here. I might not get anything this time. Okay, try this. Come on. If it rolls forward, it'll go into the hole, right? Oh! Oh, yes! I got the brown teddy. I got a brown teddy bear. Yeah! Teddy! I got a teddy. Congratulations. Congratulations. Cud Cuddly Cub Brown. Should we go again? How do I move over to the other machine to get a penguin? I can't. Oh, wait a minute. What's this? Lava fragment. Maybe I should get a monkey from Super Monkey Ball. Let's get a monkey. Let's try to get the big one. All right, come on. Give me the big boy. No, it's not even close. Ah. Derek says that Spike Out Battle Street is a beat em up video game that was for Xbox. Oh, I never even heard about it. I never even played it or heard about it. Alright, that did not work well. Get this one! Come on! I need that monkey! I need that monkey! Oh! Give me that monkey. Or if I miss it, dump it in the hole. Right? Pick it up and dump it in the hole. Dump it in, dump it in. Oh! 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 Monkey! Got the monkey! Monkey! I, I, the monkey. Very nice. Got that I, I. What is this? This is a fishing game. Look at this. Get bass. We'll do that later. I, I mean, I want to get through the intro today. At least I got some uh, stuffed animals. There you go. And you can give one of those to Sayako. Give her a nice I, I monkey. Or a teddy bear. A nice teddy bear. Poseidon powder. Herb. A natural herb. Another natural herb. As opposed to all those unnatural herbs you find everywhere. This one's very natural. Half empty drink. Ew. <laughs> Someone already drank half of it. You picked up the other half. Ew. <clears throat> What is all the paper plates? Those are worth like nothing, right? Something for like two yen. Natural herbs. Natural herbs. Natural herbs. Iron fragments. Peach steps. Little peach steps. Let's do it. Cool. Combo into the other one. Nice. I did, oh, I beat them both. I beat them both with the combo. That was sick. <clears throat> Very nice. 
Uh, I don't remember if I had a teddy bear when I was a kid. I did have stuff, some stuffed animals. Oh, this is the weapon store. Of course, it's a different kind of store in the game. But you could buy weapons here. A nice jumbo sausage. <laughs> can I get any of these? Like, what can I equip? Does it show what you can actually equip? Oh, I don't think I can use either of these. See, they're red. So I'm going to assume you can't use the ones that are red, correct? Well, if you click on it, does it say who can equip it? Oh, wait a minute. It's per job. So whatever the sword is or the magic is, but I don't think I'm either of those, am I? I can't tell. I wish you could tell what what job is for what. I don't think this is for either. Gore boots. Some underwear? Who wants to buy a pair of underwear? <clears throat> or a hoodie? <clears throat> I can't buy the Great Fortune Silver Undies or Golden Undies yet. They're way too high level for me. A health ring. Oh, I can't equip that either. I don't have, well, I don't have money to begin with, right? <clears throat> His avatar will light up if he can use it. So he can use these. Got it. He can use these. There we go. <clears throat> okay. Oh yeah, this game is still a full RPG game and everything. You need to get past the info to get more into the our equipment. Okay. Well, that's what we're working on. I knew it was going to be an insanely long intro. I, I honestly didn't think we were going to get through it today, which doesn't look like we are. We've got about <clears throat> an hour and a half left on stream. I don't see us beating the intro in that amount of time. Okay. The undies were not as good as the hoodie. The hoodie was slightly better. No headgear yet. Okay. Again, whose is this? If there's a bunch of women's clothing over there, whose house is this really? Right? How do you even get it? I don't get it. You're not explaining. <laughs> All right. How long does it take to get to Hawaii? Several weeks, I think. Right? At this rate. Well, he's wearing the fancy suit. Hey. <laughs> Am I late? Yes. No, not at all. Actually, uh, I just got here. <laughs> Look, you don't have to be so nervous. Oh, wow. Duh. I can tell you went all out for today, Ichiban. Oh, you mean uh, the guys helped me pick this out. <laughs> this, is it weird? <laughs> no. I think you look nice. Thank guys not wearing the hemp. So, where are we off to? <clears throat> oh, uh, first things first. First things first, there's a teddy bear. <laughs> We're terribly <clears throat> sorry. Please come again soon. What? Oh, they're full too. All the restaurants are full? So much for planning ahead. If I had a bunch of places picked out, how's every one of them full? Well, it is lunchtime, so I guess it makes sense. Damn. Let's try somewhere else. Sorry. Those were all the places I had in mind. Oh, really? Guess we should have made reservations ahead of time. Oh, I'm sorry. I should have thought about that. What am I doing? Where the hell do we go? Hang on, I probably should be the only one picking uh, here. Sachan, <clears throat> is there anywhere you'd want to go? Me? Well, actually, yeah, there is. Oh, then hey, let's try to get a table. Oh, it's uh, not a place to eat. Huh? What is it then? What, do I have to spell it out for you? I mean, you're the one getting all fidgety. Is she for real? We've been walking all this time, right? Let's stop by. The hotel? <laughs> I assumed you were feeling the same way. But, but it's still light out. Is that what she's talking about, though? Since when does that matter? 
day or night, I could really This is not what right she's now. talking about. He's getting totally the wrong idea. She really doesn't mince words, does she? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. What would Namba or Adachi do at a time like this? What would anyone do? You gotta play it cool. Play it cool. Passion up. Jumping straight into a hotel isn't exactly wholesome. Gotta keep it cool, shut this thing down before feelings get hurt. You know, Sacha, <clears throat> hmm. do you, uh, you know, do this kind of thing often? Well, I guess. <laughs> I'm usually always... See, he doesn't know what she's talking about. He's an idiot. Uh, how would you feel Told if ya. someone you love was doing the same thing? Hmm. Well, I guess it's not something to be proud of. Right, so the hotel's probably a little fast, huh? What? A hotel? <laughs> Where did you get that idea? Well, he's a moron. Huh? Wasn't that one? I meant I could use a cigarette. I knew that's what you was going to say. A cigarette. There's a smoking area a little ways up ahead. See? Oh, 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 oh right. Duh. Yeah, smoking. I, I knew that's what you meant. Yes, sure. Let's smoke. Heck, maybe I'll have two. What a dunce. Are you okay, Ichiban? <laughs> He's such a dummy. Think you need it at the hot dog stand, I guess. Now things are awkward. I still don't have a backup plan. Come on, think. I gotta get the conversation going. What should we talk about? Nanba or Adachi? Why do you want to talk about either of them? <laughs> of all the things to talk about. Why would you talk to them about them? Oh, come on. Talk about a freaking squashed, you know... A squashed uh, Takayaki in the street or something. Who cares about them? Uh, we have to choose them. Who can fucking... Who cares? Talk about not weirdo Namba. You know, I wonder what Namba looks like without his glasses. Why? Oh, well, it's just I realized I've never seen him without... Wait a minute, that's bullshit. Didn't he take him off in the first game when he revealed that he wasn't really who he said he was, that he was undercover the whole time? I'm almost positive he didn't have glasses for a part of the first game. Hey, you're right. Well, now I'm kind of curious, too. What if he's actually super hot or something? Aw, <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's kind of mean to Nanchan. Still, he could use a little spiffing up. <laughs> Get his hair done and stuff. I know. We should plan the guy a makeover one of these days. Adachi san can help out too. <laughs> yeah, that sounds fun. Oh my god. <laughs> hey, hey, plan on it then. Say, wouldn't you rather spend more time with Nanchan and Adachi san than be on a date with me? Uh, huh? What's up, lucky gremlin? How you I doing? Mean, you seem like you really perk up whenever you talk about them. Oh, no, I, I didn't. Just something we have in common is all. <laughs> I'm only kidding. Oh, right. Speaking of those two, I just remember. They were telling me about a place near Jinnai Station that's supposed to be pretty good. You maybe want to go there now? <laughs> sure. Yeah, let's do it. <clears throat> All right. Talking about Namba actually paid off. Time to make a comeback. Uh, so what's this place? Knowing them, it's some shitty place. Watch. <clears throat> why, why here? There's no one else there. Of all the places, why a fancy capo restaurant? Whoa, look at this counter. Is that real Hinoki Cypress? Sh sure is. Everything okay, Ichiban? Yeah, I just assumed the place would be a little more casual, <laughs> seeing as Namba and Adachi suggested it. I doubt those two have ever actually been here. <laughs> actually, come to think of it, all they said was that the place had good atmosphere. Great, thanks a lot, guys. Capo has, like, etiquette and rules. I don't know jack about any of that. Here, let's order something. Uh, okay. Calm down, Ichi. It's just Capo, not some ritzy French or Italian place. It's Japanese food. You eat that all the time. Yeah, let's look at the menu. <laughs> <clears throat> I can't even read these. <laughs> All right. I think I'm going to try this. I'll have the shunkoku gyo, please. Oh, miss, that's actually read Harutsugeuo. Oh, 
really? I, I'm sorry. Sachan made a mistake. Oh jeez, <laughs> this is embarrassing. I don't understand. I don't. Is it supposed to be like? Is it supposed to be like a weird place? I don't. Why could you be able to read it? It's not in the same language or something. That's very. Uh, it's Japanese food, but it's the the menu is not in Japanese. I don't get it. She's embarrassed. What's the best thing to do here? <clears throat> Cover for her. I can't let Sachan stew away in silence over this. I gotta let her know things are okay. There's no need to be embarrassed, Sachan. Looking at it myself, I doubt many people can read everything on the menu. For one thing, a little pronunciation guide wouldn't hurt. Oh, no, you don't have to say that. It's our first time here, after all. I couldn't help but hear, sir. You find our menu unsatisfactory? That's right, asshole! Uh, no, we're sorry. Everything's just great. Well, actually, he has a point. Uh, huh? A lot of first-time customers tend to get discouraged by our menu. We've had trouble keeping regulars as of late. Upon trying to determine the cause, I thought perhaps our emphasis on formality uh -huh. set the bar a little too high. Uh, thank you to Lucky Gremlin for a super chat. He says... Hinoki cypress is a plant famous in Japan and Central Asia. That's interesting. Thank you for the super chat there. And uh, Cracker Jacks, how you doing? He says, how you doing, Phil? I'm doing all right. It's a very slow intro, but that's what's to be expected from this franchise. Like, I wasn't... I wasn't expecting this game to go right into full-on, you know, crazy RPG gameplay. At the same time, this is a really slow intro. We're almost two hours into the game, and almost nothing's happened yet. So... <clears throat> Let's hope that by the end of today's stream, something happens. I mean, this is it's, it's entertaining and funny, but I don't know how this is leading into the game. You know what I mean? This is like an episode of a sitcom. So, all right, let's keep going. Sure, formal's great and all, but when it starts intimidating you, it kind of loses its luster a bit. You're absolutely right. To that end, we'll be adding pronunciations to the menu as ah. soon as possible. Thank you for being so open and honest. Wow, they're updating the menu thanks to you, Ichiban. You didn't let the fancy atmosphere stop you or anything. <laughs> I'm impressed. <laughs> I just said what I was thinking. I mean, look at this. They put these two kanji together, but who's ever going to be able to read that? Well, actually, that's just shrimp. <laughs> what? <laughs> shrimp? Even I could read that. Now you're embarrassing me. Now, now, allow us to offer some onmitsu for dessert on us as a token of our appreciation. Really? Oh, I love onmitsu. Thank you so much. Definitely should have been smoother there, but Sachan's happy, so well done. Ugh. I don't even know what they eat. Like, what was that restaurant? I don't even understand it. Why was it complicated to Ooh. order? I don't get it. Ooh, and what did they eat? Kapo style was so good. <clears throat> Seriously, that was delicious. Yeah, I wonder what Capo style is. I don't know if I would have ever gone there if not for our date. Thank you so much, Ichiban. Yeah. <laughs> What's up, Roger? How oh, you really? doing? Hey, I'm just happy you're happy. Ugh, now, what did I no say? Way. What did I say? Something What's bad up? was going to happen. See that guy <clears throat> walking toward us right now? You mean those three guys? The one leading him? His name's Tanaka. He used to be a regular of mine. At your cabaret club? Yeah. He's president of an IT venture firm, but money or not, it doesn't make up for how he acts. Huh. He would lie to all the other customers saying I was his girl, so I banned him from the club. Haha, -ha, good. Fuck Even him. after all that, he'd wait for me <clears throat> at the back door. So he's a fucking creep. So I made up my own lie <clears throat> and told him I had a boy. <clears throat> Excuse me. Jeez, that's pretty bad. Yeah, but he doesn't give up. He'll beat his ass. He'd tell me, you're lying, or there's no way you have a boyfriend. And worse, he still hangs out back sometimes. Think he sees through you, or do you just need to be more convincing? <sighs> I'm not sure, but he says he can read people like a book. Yeah, but now she's with you. Anyway, this so tell him to fuck off. Ichiban, play along, okay? <clears throat> yeah. Huh? <clears throat> it's all up to you. Now, act like you're my boyfriend. There you go. Boyfriend? Uh, but... This is so sudden. <laughs> huh? Saiko-san, what a coincidence. What are you doing here? 
What? Isn't it obvious? I'm on a date with my boyfriend. Boyfriend? You mean the dressed up caveman? Hey there! My name is Ichiban Kasuga, and I'm dating Psycho Sock. Oh Wait, my god. Subtle. <clears throat> Do you believe me now that I have a boyfriend? Of course not. Come on. You know I can read people like nobody's business. This poor guy doesn't look even remotely your type. No way, no how. All right, better start acting like her boyfriend. What kind of guy would be a good match for Sachan? Definitely never crossed my mind before. You're, you're on a date with her, you fucking idiot. I got like Namba down to earth or Adachi cool and stylish. <clears throat> uh, why is it to be like these two assholes? <laughs> How about nothing? Because she would be with them if she liked them. She doesn't like either of them. So it's a neither answer. Be yourself. This is so dumb. I don't even care. I seriously don't even care. I'm going to close my eyes and pick one. Here we go. Ready? I have no idea what it's on right now, and I'm going to go with this. Okay. What did I get? A sophisticated guy like Sachan should have someone cool and stylish. There you go. I don't want to lie. It's all how you phrase it. I could do that. All right. So, you're Sakura-san's boyfriend? Okay, then. And what do you do for work? Well, you might say I listen to other people's problems and point them in the right direction. Technically, that is what I do at Hello Work. Not that big of a stretch. Huh. So you're a consultant? Yeah. All right, then. What kind of firms do you typically work with? <laughs> nah, the work I do is more about the individuals, actually. A financial planner, huh? Promising industry. Good for the future. If only that was true. <laughs> okay, <clears throat> if you're so set, why make Saiko-san work at a cabaret club? If it were me, I'd have her get some kind of certification and get her out of the business. What's wrong with working in a cabaret club? Simple. There's no future in it. Not to mention her reputation. That's horseshit. There's nothing wrong with taking your job seriously. Passion opens all kinds of doors. A hell of a lot more than some certification. <laughs> There's a good future with any job. As long as you're doing your best. If you can't support her, you never had a chance. Mm. Ichiban. Damn! Told him. <laughs> Supporter? What's that gonna do? You really have to ask that? <laughs> Ugh, you must be stupid. There's nothing like having someone who supports your dreams. Knowing they care can give you the strength to keep going. That's the kind of man I'd want. I'm glad Ichiban is my boyfriend. You serious, Sako-san? You're really telling me this scruffy-looking oaf is your boyfriend? You didn't hear me the first time? But... No, 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 no. <laughs> How can I lose to a dumpy guy like you? <laughs> yep, you lost. So can you please promise to stop following me around? Sure, I'll promise. Right after I teach you two a lesson. Oh, my God. What? You want to crush my heart? Fine, I'll crush you. <laughs> what an asshole. Here we go. The battle is on. <clears throat> so she's going to fight, too. Your allies' positioning opens up a variety of strategic possibilities like knockback chains, allowing them to follow up after an enemy is knocked in their direction, and back attacks against enemies who have their attention divided. Many of these attacks will provide extra damage. Be sure to use them. So I should try to knock them into her for a combo. Here you go. A back attack. Oh, he's already dead. <laughs> Activate auto battle with left trigger and they'll fight on their own. Okay. I wonder why I got two turns. I can't really. Yeah, see, they're too far away, so. Right. Let's see what her abilities are. Boundless cheer, boost attack of Sayako and nearby enemy. Eh, I want to kick some ass. Let's kick this guy's ass. Right. How dare you! Quickly while he's down. Follow up. Look at this! Oh! <laughs> now, that's, now that's what you're talking about. He's down smashing with a trash can. Very nice. Very nice. Ugh. That's right. 
some trash for the trash. What an asshole. Now you ruined the suit. Man, what an asshole. Well, at the very least, it looks like he's done following you around, Sachan. Thanks, Ichiban. Way to play the part. Your little ad lib at the end was amazing. <laughs> hey, my pleasure. If only I could tell her that ad lib was the real deal. Still, <clears throat> Jerk totally ruined your new clothes. I'm so sorry. Ugh, it's all my fault. Nah, they're just clothes. But, um, I should probably go freshen up. If it's all right, would you mind waiting a little bit? I'll go change. Okay, I'll be right here. Great, be right back. Oh, uh, where's he going to change? He's running all the way home? I guess so. Now we get a slideshow. And they went, oh, well, I already won the claw game. Wait a minute. I already won the claw game. Why do I have to get another one? And they played darts. <laughs> what a slideshow. What is that? A bun? One of those steamed buns? Yup. Exactly what it is. There you go. <laughs> oh, now they're on the waterfront from the first Sorry. game. Couldn't find a vending machine. No worries. Ooh, prime energy drink. Disgusting. <laughs> <laughs> this know, is for five-year-olds who play sure Fortnite. This was gonna go, but I had fun. Thanks, Ichiban. Oh, uh, sure. Happy it all worked out. <sighs> you okay? <laughs> so listen, I know I used to be a Yakuza and all. And now that I quit, I'm basically just scraping by every day. I Ichiban, what, what is this all about? Uh, I'm not very bright, and I suck at studying, too. For real, Captain Sawashiro's been calling me a dumbass since the day we met. <laughs> but still, I'm working a study job now, and I take it really seriously. I think I even got a good reputation at the office, too. Physically speaking, I'd say I'm pretty strong. I mean... I'm nothing compared to a guy like Kiryu-san. But I definitely know how to hold my own. I don't drink or smoke too much either. And I can't say I don't gamble, but, well, it's mostly just a hobby, you know? The point is, I don't really have too much to offer. Oh, a heartfelt scene. But when it comes to you, I give everything I have just to make you happy. So, uh... Let me ask you. <laughs> Will you marry me? <laughs> Will you marry me? What the fuck? He actually said that. What the fuck is shit? <laughs> what the fuck? He actually said that. Are you shitting me? I was joking and he I said swear it. On my honor as a man, no matter what happens. Such what is going I will on? I'll be there for you. <laughs> Listen, I know how hard it is to go it alone. Especially she, she, she should jump in the water and the swim away club cartoonishly. Oh, while looking after your dad and sister? That's incredible. But if we're together, you won't have to bear all that on your own. Anymore. Oh my god. I'll help you look after your dad. And if anything at all happens with Nanoha, I'll be right there. Oh my god, he's insane. You won't even have to work. You can hang at home and leave the rest to me. And I wouldn't push all the housework on you either. I'll clean. Cook, <laughs> do laundry, he's going so shop, overboard. Whatever you want. <clears throat> and if we have a kid, you can bet I'll raise What the right. hell is he talking about? And then one day, oh my maybe god. We can visit Arakawa san's grave together. I tell him. Look at this happy family. Holy shit! You can rest easy up there, cause I'm doing just <laughs> fine down here. He's insane. Uh, Sacha. Thanks again, Ichiban. Today really was fun. Wait. Uh -huh. Hey, hang on a sec. Sachan. did. 
Did I say something wrong? Yeah, what do you think? No. No, nothing <clears throat> like that. I just need to get home. Up early tomorrow, you know? <laughs> it's probably the same for you too, right? Anyway, let's just keep at it. Um, but I... Uh, what's your answer? <laughs> She's gonna pretend like he never said it because she's a fucking idiot. <clears throat> oh my god. Okay, if you were to tell me, alright? No, seriously. If you were to say to me, in Like a Dragon Infinite Wealth, within the intro segment, Ichiban is going to propose to Sayako, I would have been like, so it's a comedy bit, right? Like, it's a... What? This is the furthest from what I thought the game was going to start with. I almost feel like they wanted to get this crazy stuff out of the way, right? So that when you get into the meat of the game, then you can focus on, like, the main story that's going to be, you know, very dramatic. And This is just insanity. Like, what is happening? <laughs> I'm just, what is that? I can't believe they wrote that. I mean, that's so insane. And well, we have an hour left on this stream, so let me split the part, right? And then we gotta see what else happens here. This is it's just nuts. What a premiere stream. Well, I hope you're liking the playthrough so far. I'll see you in part three and we'll see what happens. Holy shit.